topic of this video is solving linear systems of equations by substitution or elimination. At the bottom of the screen here, I have three linear systems. So you get an idea of what we are talking about. Here's the first linear system. Here's the second linear system. And here's the third linear system. How do we solve these? Let's read. To solve systems of equations by substitution or elimination, follow these steps. Step one, clear all equations of fractions if an obvious method emerges. Step two, if an x or y has a coefficient of one or negative one, solve for that x or y and use substitution. Step three, if not, use elimination. All right, let's look at these steps in detail, beginning with step two. It says, if an x or y has a coefficient of one or negative one, solve for that x or y and use substitution. All right, so what would that look like when we see it in a problem? This is a term whose coefficient is negative 1. So this is an x with a coefficient of negative 1. This is a y with a coefficient of positive 1. This is an x with a coefficient of positive 1. This is a y with a coefficient of negative 1. If you see any of those four things anywhere in your system, then solve for that variable and use the substitution method. Here's the way it works. Let's say we were working with this system and we solved the top equation for x. Then when we're done, it would say x equals something. Then in the other equation, we would replace x with what it equals from the first equation, which would give us something we can solve. And when we do, we would solve for the value of the remaining variable. Once we have the value of the remaining variable, we can plug that into any equation and solve for the value of the substituted variable. All right, let's turn our attention now to elimination. How does elimination work? With elimination, we multiply both sides of one or more equations by a number so that when the resulting equations are added, either the x terms or the y terms are opposites and therefore cancel to zero. Once we add those two equations together and eliminate one of the variables, we solve the remaining equation for the remaining variable's value. And once we know that, we plug back into any equation to solve for the eliminated variable's value. Let's look at a very short example of this. This system right here is perfectly set up for elimination. We can see this because the top equation has a term plus y and the bottom equation has a term subtract y. So if we were to add these two equations together, on the left we would have x plus x, which is 2x, plus y minus y, which cancels, and 8 plus 2, which is 10. So the resulting equation would say 2x equals 10, which is very easy to solve. Divide by two on both sides and get x equals five. Okay, so this is how you solve systems of linear equations by substitution or elimination. We have several example videos to share as well.